You can rep lip is now going to be a giveaway lip. I'll figure out what I want to do, what kind of contest or whatever. But we're gonna replace it with this bad boy. Whatever the hell you call this thing. Exxon, Exxon, Xenon, Xena. Uh, lip. This is one of the dream lips I've wanted. The only bad is that it's fiberglass, so it'll break. Previous owner. Definitely had some issues. But I got some nice nice washers to stick on here to hopefully keep the rigidity, keep it strong. This came in a two-piece. You can see the line right there. It's pretty tight. It's gonna look good. So, the shitty part, I gotta take this bumper off. So, remove the battery, remove the bumper, unplug the lights. The turret signals are a bitch because I always drop the uh, screws down in the bumper. So we'll see how this goes. The goal is to get this lip on. And, in a week or so, I'm gonna be moving down to Colorado. So from Oregon to Colorado, if anybody living down in Colorado. I'm going to record if you want to meet up. Let's shoot some videos, talk some shit. Hit the uh, nationwide meet. Let's see how it goes. I totally forgot how to take this fucker off. I forgot about these guys. So I took a minute. Had to find a screwdriver for the turn signals. See, with this one, I just half assed. Screw this in. As you can see, they pop out whenever you hit something. Scrape. Hopefully, I can bolt that bad boy to the holes already here. Fucking shit. Yeah, so this lip can be yours. Comment down below what kind of contest I should do to see who can win this lip. Did you have to buy them?
so this might be pushed in or might leave it out that hole lines up in the middle this guy lines up edge to edge might need a drill fucking right there I didn't even think about it, but the guy before already has holes drilled into the lip that match up with the holes that are already in the OEM bumper. So all I gotta do is throw some fucking washers in this so it don't fuck the fiberglass up. And the holes are kind of small, but I can screw these in. Bam, just like that. It's looking nice on the other side. I got these so they can bite down. Hopefully not come loose. Fitment. Pretty fucking beautiful. So, this guy, that guy. Ooh, baby, right there, this guy. Right in that hole. And I think. Maybe drill a second hole here so it really holds on tight, but I want to see how tight these three hold on. It'd be nice if I can get all these extra ones filled up with this guy. But that barely reaches. It doesn't reach. I'm trying to flex that fiberglass, but you don't want to break it. Previous owner. Looks like he had it right there, though. But. Fogs. Fogs and cobs. Right, let's put this bitch on and uh, see how it feels sturdy wise. Throw you on the time lapse. Got a little splitting going on right there. And on the other side. So once it's fully on, I'm gonna bondo that spot. Fucking sand it down and repaint it. And probably throw some on the back to keep it sturdy. That shit's breaking. And one issue, seems like there might be a gap right here, but we'll see how that looks once I flip it over because you might, might not even see that. And if it's an issue, I will address it later because I would have to get in here somehow where he tried, broke it, throw something here, tighten that down. This lip of fiberglass actually angles upward. So I think once it's pressed down, it might break, maybe not. Three bolts, paid a hundred bucks for this bad boy. The guy has three total, so. If I want one in the future, I guess I can just order one, wait online, wait for that to ship. This was two hours away, so I went ahead and picked it up. I'll throw in some footage of the guy's vehicle and the lip when I picked it up. It's got a nice little uh, eight swap going on. Daddy. Were you selling this car? I was. Parting it out or something? I was. Not anymore? Not anymore. I like the yellow calipers. Yeah, I'm gonna do the five lap table, the whole cables, everything. That's crazy. I gotta do these. Basically, all I gotta do. So, it is on, those are tightened. 
Let's see how it looks when I flip it. Let's see how sturdy it is. Oh, it's really on there. A little sketchy in the middle. Ooh. Oh shit. Oh, that's sexy. So it does sag on the left and right, but I'm pretty sure I've seen other guys up the same lip that had that piece sag down right there. That's tight. I'm really curious how much lower this sits than the uh, Mugen Rep lip I had. All right, let's throw this fucker on and we'll see. Oh yeah, bolts, baby. Don't forget your bolts. Oh, I got the uh, side pieces for the hood bra, but I don't have the buttons because the chick I bought it off of from a parking lot. It's going to the mall. This is a chick in the parking lot. She was on her lunch break. Long story short, I didn't have a screwdriver to take off those pieces, but I was like, fuck it. I'll take it. So if I see her again, I'll take those. It's going to be a whole different look. I didn't like the lip I had simply because... The edges were wide open right here. So it kind of looked like a garden trim on the side, but these are filled out. That side piece looks tight. And I do like the way that looks with the two holes and the little curve in the middle. It looks pretty sick. Seeing a photo of a guy that ran a tow hook out of that hole. I'll throw a photo up. They're inside this right here. Ooh. Love you. 